Hello fellow drillers, here with another tutorial video. These new drills that we're running lately all have a digital tape, which some of us don't really like just because it's easier to use the old cable system. The digital tape does a pretty good job, but you have to know how to use it properly in order to make it work for you. So what we're going to do here is a short video on how to properly take apart a rod and let the computer show, let the computer do it for you on this stop points. So I've got two rods put together. I've got one pushed out a little bit, a little ways. You'll notice we're at 83, 84 inches. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to pull back on the stick. I'm just pulling it back normal. It would just keep going if I was pre-reaming or pulling back and I'm not letting go of the stick. And it stops by itself. Once you get there, you let off of the stick. Go ahead and close your front jaw, back jaw, rotate it, let loose. And then we're gonna forward reverse our rotation. Once we come unscrewed, we're going to look back over here and we're just going to ease back on the controls and pull back on it. And it stops on its own again. If you bounce the controller back and forth as you're trying to go to that second stop point, it will miss it. So you have to ease back on it until it gets to the second point. Once you're at your second point, we can go ahead and lock our back jaw, bring our rod loading arms in. Set the arms down. Go ahead and reverse our rotation in the rear until it's loose and then pull back. Sometimes the pullback on these are a little slower than what we're used to on the non-digital taped machines. Make sure when you look over here that you're at 130, 131 after you've pulled back off of the rod with your drive motor. If not, it's still attached to the rod in the back and then we have a, a hang up issue so from here we would undo the second jaw the back one on a finger switch underneath the control right here i'm going to put that rod away and then we'll lift it back up come back down to get our next one When we come in for the next one, we're going to rotate nice and easy until we bump it. And then we quit pushing and then we let it rotate nice and easy until we complete our makeup. Now we're completed. Open our jaw and we go for the next rod. That's it for this video.